Welcome folks, this is Chris Gossman with Quake Live TV and as you are probably seeing, things look a little bit different tonight. We're, we're trying uh, at least two different things. Uh, the first one is that we are giving a, a little guinea pig run of owned TV a shot tonight and we're going to try to use uh, Pitmic 7. So, um, you know, we're going to be a little bit more bland with the visuals tonight, but hopefully a lot smoother and a lot easier for viewers to see because, uh, you know, just, we've been getting a, a fair amount of complaints. And to be quite honest, um, I, I was doing a lot of research into the uh, bitrate troubles we were having. And uh, I think, unfortunately, Ustream was to blame. I was doing some tests earlier today and found that my bitrate did not seem to dip at all using this particular provider. Well, and, uh, I'm looking at the stream right now. Yeah. It looks a hundred times better than it yeah. has in the past. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've we've done, you know, honestly, we've done a year, um, more than a year in uh, Picnip Zero. And to be quite honest, uh, uh, I've been thinking about this change for a long time. So I think we're going to test drive it a little bit. Nothing's really set in stone here, folks. And we're uh, co-hosts and guests tonight. We have TGM from Quake Live TV and Sir Dark from Quake Night. How you guys doing? Good evening, team. Hey. What is up, people? What's up, all my <laughs> fans out there? Just want to say what's up. I know you guys have been missing me on the shoutcast. All three of them. Yes. Nah. Uh -huh. Three of them. And, and none of them actually use a name. They all use Ustreamer Mibit clients, so I don't even know who they are. <laughs> That's how I like it. Always been kind of an exhibitionist. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I know that uh, I, I heard the little chuckle in the background, so I know they got Slava around as well. How you doing, man? I am wonderful. So are you getting a Google Fiber at your new place? Uh, no. Is that even a possibility? I need to find that out. What are you bantering about during downtime, Greased? Talking about getting really nice internets, man. And uh, yeah, I've check been out. We're setting it up all day. Yeah, we're 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 gonna give yeah, a I'm shot. Yeah, I'm digging this. I'm digging the stream, dude. This the is looking pretty owned, sexy. Owned TV, man. Yeah. You know, you, you, I remember you talking about this a few months ago. I I never thought you would actually go in for it. <laughs> I, I know you like to play foreplay with this kind of stuff, but here you are doing the whole thing, and uh, we're getting ready for the money shot here. Well, yeah, I, I figured it was it was time to stop playing just the tip. So. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, this is going to be bad news, probably. Has Scooby and DeHang already played? Nope, they are scheduled to. Right after this. See. See, Jahar. Jahar, worry not, my amigo. Uh, dreams do come uh, true. <laughs> it was snowing today, and I was working on a metal roof, and it was just taking forever. I was like, shit, no, I'm gonna miss it. Did uh, you, did you, like, cold freeze your balls to the roof, man? You know what? It, pretty much, yeah, because it was snowing, and there was actually a time when I went to take my hand up, and I had to, like, pull a little harder because it was stuck, because, so... Honestly, not, dude, not, like, not right my now, balls, my I, I'm, I'm thinking about, um, no. was it a Christmas story? You know, and that little kid, he puts his tongue on the pole. Yeah. It's stuck! It's stuck! I can just totally imagine you up on I a roof, know. you know, squatting, and... Out here back west, I don't know how they do it over there, man, but <laughs> out here back west, when we're playing on roofs, we usually wear pants. Oh, 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 right, yeah. Details. <laughs> Alright. We almost have all four players on the server. Maybe. So it's supposed to be uh, Plague and Waz, I think, are the are the two guys on this new team that kind of stepped up, stepped up to the plates. So we'll go ahead and talk about them. This is Chronic Insanity. And uh, they're going to be facing off against the Phoneman. The Phoneman who we saw last week in uh, very nice shape. Um, although, we're going to see a little bit of a change... No, no we're not, no we're not, no we're not. Uh, we're just seeing a little bit of a change of alias. Um, looks like... Right, because yeah. Yeah, Zerpsy, that's, that's another one of uh, KGB's aliases, right? He's got like eight. I don't know, I lose track. We probably won't make any more config changes tonight. But, uh, if you would like to submit 
um, you know, additional changes to do so on our forums. But we're going to go live now, so we're going to focus on that. This again is Chronic Insanity facing off against the phone. And we're going to watch Waz right off the spawn going for MG. Not really getting hit uh, by any sort of damage. And he did lay in a little bit of MG against his opponent. And uh, this is the first time I think we're going to be able to see Chronic Insanity play. As I understand, they are kind of stepping up to fill the gap left by Dance Dance Revolution slash uh, Daily Doses Rage. So, Waz covering center, waiting for red. And uh, just kind of chilling. Makes the move to red and uh, assists Plague to get an MG frag. So, a nice little bit of Cess action there. And uh, 13 seconds until that quad, Waz is here way early and only has MG to defend, but he is really using it to great effect. So let's take a look. Yeah, 35% MG, that's not too bad. I mean, TGM? Uh, Play kind of gets... came in to save the day there for him with that yeah. plasma gun. Yeah. And Waz is going to get the first quad here. Yeah, but without a whole lot of weapons, really, he's walking around with eight. Plasma balls. And in the meantime, the phone men are hiding pretty well. We've got MG that might kill this quad carrier if Waz keeps whiffing oh, rails man. and finally takes down Swooped. But uh, kind of precarious. He misses another one. Five health, and he will go down. Swooped gets revenge. And it's now tied four to four. Yeah, that's kind of uncharacteristic for Waz. If he missing these, uh, I guess, easier rails, I guess you could call them. Well,. I don't know. I, I kind of think that Waz is one of those uh, players who needs to warm up a bit. And I'm wondering how yeah, absolutely. Uh, in the zone he is. Two minutes in, we'll give him some slack. Like, there's a couple good rails by him. Mm hmm. Yeah, a little bit better. Oh, that's a nice one. That'll pick up <laughs> a nice five frag lead. And uh, I think this is the first real challenge we've seen for Defone Men. Um, because uh, last week, if I recall correctly, the phoneman kind of uh, melted faces. And uh, we, we actually, um, no wait, wait, maybe I'm thinking of even a week before that, because I don't think I was here last week. <laughs> I'm losing track. So much quick. Well, but, no, you were um, right. Uh, last week, uh, the phoneman played uh, Blight Gaming, and uh, yeah, pretty much uh, yeah, took it Yeah, it was it pretty apart. much too old. Okay. I mean, the first one in yeah, Zetian was pretty close, but still. Second game was gonna, double the score. We're gonna have a quad coming up here, and no one's in the room yet, I don't think. Yeah, but Waz just got the preceding red armor, so he's racing along with his uh, teammate. Plate goes down, and they tr they try to stagger the entrance, but look at the defensive shotgun, and then followed up with, the, uh, with uh, aggressive plasma as that quad damage was picked up. And let's go see if we can find uh, Swoop as he starts to put it to pretty good use. Needing to kill Waz, switches up the shotgun to get the job done. And this is the chance to close the gap and score 34 health for this quad carrier. And he's able to pull down Plague. And he should be able to get Waz as well. That's now 11 to 14. This is a nice little comeback for DFM. And it looks like the lead for CI may indeed be temporary. It's now only two frags. A great quad run there by Swoop. As for, I guess we'll see if this uh that quad run looks like looks like Foam and I have a little better control of this middle of the map here with the red armor. Yeah. Which is where they were it, they really didn't have control of this at the beginning. I mean CI kinda had that area on lockdown. Well it looks like, you know, Waz and his teammate are just kinda hanging out at Plasma Yellow, trying to work up a little bit of an armor stack before going out to center. Waz does have red time, and I think he's gonna get it pretty freely. Oh, he jumps away and it is a mistake to die for. As he gets railed off, it's going to take a look. Plague now, trying to deal damage in center, but 53 health can be railed off. Going to be double teamed. He picks up the pair of 25s, but it's not enough in order to dodge. There is no spoons. Deathly railgun. That is the second impressive for Mr. KGB. And uh, the phone men have just taken the lead 15 to 14. Now, uh, frankly, CTM, that means that CI have not scored a frag since we last. Um, since uh, the quad run, I guess. 